Oh my god, it is so hot today, it's ridiculous. And I'm being blinded by these lights that are lining up my face. So we're going to play Little Light like Nightmares 2. Uh, I'm going to go back to the beginning. So I played the first one a while ago. And I uh, didn't actually know they released the second one, I checked um, and saw it advertised on Steam. So we're going to play this, it's the Enhanced Edition. Alright, so I wanted to record this game in 4K, but I couldn't record in 4K and stream at the same time, so I'm playing it at 1080p, uh, which is a shame. I really wanted to do it in 4K, but it would just it would just lag. Uh, I, I, I have two PCs, right? I have a streaming PC and a gaming PC, and they're, they're both gaming PCs, really. Um, and even if I had one, my main PC play the game, and my back of my stream PC stream the game, it was it was still still awful. Still uh, not not acceptable in, in my opinion. So 1080p, 60 FPS, it'll have to do. I mean that is a standard, but I, just, I really wanted to get a, get a 4K stream going, not a 4K recording. But fine enough, messing around. Let's play Late Night Maze 2. Love the first game. This is the enhanced edition, so I don't know what that means. Maybe it looks better than before. And there's also some DLC that comes with it. I think it's just like cosmetics, but we'll see what happens. Let's start a new game. Let's let me know if it is too quiet for you or not. Because it is a quiet game. It's very, uh, it's all about the ambiance. So I have played like the first minute of this just to test the stream. Because I'm playing this, <coughs> I'm playing this on the, my PC upstairs and streaming it from my stream PC. So i have to see how it goes. When I was doing this at 4K, my PC was on fire. It was ridiculous how hot it got. And uh, the fans were blaring. And it's already a really hot day today in the UK. So I don't want to melt my PC, you know. Hmm. Were those doors in the first game? Uh, I don't remember if they were. Actually, they were. They were the... Um well, like spotlights, and if they saw you, they they tried to kill you. I might be thinking of um, inside. <clears throat> Meanwhile, I'll play as a new character. We can select hats. Oh, we need to unlock these. Fair enough. We're now Bagman. <laughs> got a cool little coat with some phys physics going on there. I love that. I've got like a cardboard bag of what is it? Cardboard bag. Got it. Paper bag. That's what I'm looking for. <clears throat> So I guess the character must be like really ugly. We'll find out. So there's a TV here, and it looks like there's stuff in the background. Like I think they're, they're like luggage. Got a toy cube. I'm figuring out the controls. I played on a with a mouse and keyboard before. This is play with a controller now. I think I'll hold down square or sprint. And look at that! The leaves like kick up around you as you're running along. It's so good. Uh, I hope it uh, it records well. So I don't know what that is. Is that like a beehive? Oh, it's like a decaying body. It's really hard to see. All right, jump. There's something else back here. Is that like a, a luggage or a cage? Put the brightness on the in the recommended settings. I have to see how like how that goes on. I love this. I love the lighting. It's so good. Being reflected off my uh, my bag head. And this is how far I've got my, my uh, test stream, so we'll see what it looks like. So we've got a shoe. Is this a trap? It's not a trap. Is that, uh, that, that looks like a trap there in the background there. <laughs> Maybe this shoe belongs to one of them. They're all shoeless, so it seems like someone's been stripping them of their shoes, but that's... Um, Something to look out for, I guess. You can have one of your shoes back, there you go. Okay, already off to a grim stop. Just like the Little Nightmares, um, Little Nightmares 1. There was a hanged body in the first room of the game. Getting some um, Limbo vibes from this. It's like the same sort of setting, like in the, in the woods, it's all dark and creepy. I need to remember I can grab onto ledges by holding like, the, the grab button, which I know sort of makes sense. Oh, that's going to be a trap. Let's try and get around it. Can I go behind the tree? 
I want to trigger it, I want to see what happens. It looks like there's guts there on the ground. I'm going to stay out of there, there's, there's some on the top as well. Can I look up? Is that a birdhouse? In fact, let's look up over here. So I reckon that would drop on our heads and kill us. Oh my god, this is so... So, uh, limbo. Can I not move this? It looks like I should be able to... There we go. I was a very small child, so quite weak. I think this is a trap as well. Looking in the background, there's two of them. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh shit. Oh, this is not good. Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Did it get me? I think it got me. It did, alright. I did try my best there. But it really um, held the tension, like it gets right up to you and then it stops. I think I'm a bit ahead of where I was last time. Yeah. Okay, I guess I didn't sprint from the very beginning before. I did that time and everything is okay. And looks like I have to get to that somehow. Um, let's have a look around. I might want to turn the brightness up. Maybe just a touch. Yeah, let's do it. Alright, yeah. There we go. So I think because I'm on a different PC, the, set, the graphics are a little bit different. There we go. It's a little bit better, to be honest. Not that much, but it'll, I think it's, a, it's improvement. Right, so I need to get across. I need to go up there somehow. I think where I am is for, like, if you fail, if you, like, you drop down, you, you need to work your way back. So I guess, climb the tree. Oop, up the tree, okay. And then swing on this to get across, Tarzan style. Very badass. And then, bring this down. And that'll do, no stop, 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 oh there's momentum to it. Okay, that'll do. Oh, it goes back up on its own, okay, that's fine. There we go, that is our first puzzle solved. Easy. And then I say that I'm going to get stuck in a puzzle at some point. Music's got an ominous, that's very unsettling. Climb this? Yes we can. Oh, I hate this already, I feel like something bad's going to happen. When the music kicks in, that's when you know something's about to go horribly wrong. <laughs> oh, here we go, shoes. Speak of shoes in the last game as well. Mm, I don't remember why. Fuck off, crow. Alright, I keep this. This is my, my comfort shoe. Nope, yep, take it with us. Alright, I can see a trap there. I can see a trap up there as well, but it looks like I might need to trigger this to get up there. Oh, maybe this is what a shoe is for. Um. Oh shit, I thought it was going to land on me. Oh, I'm loving this already. I'm loving this so far. Glad I took my comfort shoe. I had to sacrifice it. It's not exa exactly like the com uh, the companion cube, but it was a companion shoe. I'll take it. Right, I'm keeping an eye, an eye out for traps, because that one was quite hidden. I can see stakes in the ground. I'm going to go... Oh, is that bear traps? Oh, right, I see them. I'm going to go around. So I can see a stake there. I don't see the wire. I don't see the trip wire if there is one. Oh, the stakes might be for, for the bear traps. That is a thing. Yeah, and there's a stick poking in one. I think that's telling us what we have to do for a puzzle, I guess. Can I take it? I can't. I have a weapon now. Oh, I'm like, um, Pyramid Head. <laughs> can I attack with it? I can. That is also quite concerning that we can attack with stuff. That means we're going to be fighting enemies at some point. 
There we go. Puzzle solved. But, I mean, if we can swing with stuff, it makes me worried we are going to have to start attacking. Because in the first game, I don't think we had any means of defence. There's another stick. I see you. And bird houses, I guess. Oh, and this leaves could be a good trap as well. I don't see him. I don't see any. Alright, well, they're really well hidden. That's not my fault. Okay, I know it gives you a stick. But I mean, if you don't know where to chuck it, you know? Alright, so about here. Yeah, and then they all set off. It's like a when you settle us in mice trap together and they all go off at once. But we are now stickless. What's that? I threw some leaves. How do I do that? Oh, I want to do that again. Um. What? All right, there's. <laughs> there are more traps in between. Okay. Okay, that's fine. But I did throw some leaves there, and that's interesting because I don't know how I did it. So I crouched down and pressed a jump. It won't do it again. And then that's also concerning, so is that going to be part of a puzzle later on and I don't know how to quite do it? Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, it's not hang around. Get across. Pine cones, is this going to be another shoe situation? Okay. Okay. Oh, there we go. Um, let's try and cast a large net of these just to be safe. Okay, I think that's good. I might be wasting these. I might need might need to save them. There we go. Oh, and it's like 2.5D, so trying to keep track of like the way you are in the 3D space is a little bit difficult. Oh, like that, like that. Oh, you're fine, you're fine, but there might be traps. Can you climb up? Oh, we're gonna die. Up. Uh, okay, we're good. <laughs> I was panicking for no reason. As is usually the case. Alright, jump across. Can I hide in this? This is like a hidey hole. Camera's zoomed in a little bit, I guess. I don't know. Might have been a collectible. You never know. The collectibles in the last one were really hard to find. Wide open field. Don't like this. <laughs> what does this mean? I want a house. Okay. There were loads of traps outside, so I reckon these people are the ones setting the traps, so we should be quite careful. There's usually monsters about. They usually like, like fucked up people. In the last game there's a guy with a foreskin, foreskin head. So let's try not... Oh, I want to sneak in. I can look for that window somehow. I want to see what I'm dealing with. Okay. Oh, I did a cool slide. Alright, you can slide. That's cool. Actually, can we open this? This looks openable. No, we cannot. Okay. Let's see what we've got. Camera transition. Oh. I hope that's not human meat. Or whatever sort of creature we are. Because I don't know if we're like a normal sized person in the giant's world. Uh, that kettle's boiling, so we're going to have to drop down. Or if, like, you know, we're just like, a really tiny person. Right, I'm trying to avoid all that stuff because if I, I'll make some noise and then the horrible creature is going to come out and scare me. Oh, here we go. There's going to be a creaky door. Oh, this game looks so good. Right, I can move in a 3D space. Oh, okay. See, I'm trying to remember. I don't think. I think like, the first game wasn't 2.5D. It was like. It was an actual 3D game. But it does lock you in on these uh, 2D parallels just to make it easier to get around. Oh, there's floaters in the air. What is that? What is all of this? Wool? 
Okay. I'm gonna have to do a bit of exploring then. Axe. Oh, that'll be good. I want it. If I think if I go for that, I'll make a lot of noise. You think? Let's get a go. Oh, we have weapons. Yeah, if that foreskin guy comes after me in this game, he's gonna get axed. Oh, it's so good. We're so fucking pyramid head, it's unbelievable. I need a massive sword. Right, I can only leave that there for the time being, so I don't know what we'll need all this for. So chop down that. Okay, right there. Oh, there's a person, a kid. With a music box. Are they playing free blind mice? Oh, there's meat hooks in there. Right, I think he might be a prisoner, so I'm gonna save him. Don't worry, it may look like we're an axe murderer. We're not, I swear. Alright, I'll leave it there, just so you know I'm friendly. You better be friendly, or I'm going back for the axe. There's numbers on the wall, so he's been here for a while. He's gonna eat us. He's gonna be like Gollum. Is that the kid from the first game? It might, I think it might be. So in the DLC for the first game, I think we play as that kid. And it does not end well for him. Alright, so he's left, he's fucked off. We saved him, but he's, he's untrustworthy, but that's, that's fine. He doesn't like us. Can we play with this? Can I do stuff? No, okay. Alright, so I'm worried now. He's gonna go out, go oh, he's going upstairs. Might go around and like alert people. He's running about like a madman. You need to be sneaky. There's monsters about. Alright. Oh, I heard a, fo a footstep. Oh, I'm hearing footsteps. You know, somebody's having some like hardcore sex in the bed upstairs. It's one of those. I have no idea. I wanna, I wanna look around. What's this? Can? Okay. Oh, I put it in my pocket. Ooh, it's a hat. Oh, it's um, like a raccoon hat. I much prefer the bag right now, to be honest. Let's have a look at what else we find. Okay. Nice, no, that's sneaky. Oh, I don't like this. They look like they look they look like puppets. Kids climb at the window. Okay, so they are they mannequins. Looks like somebody's making mannequins. But there's real food on the table. Oh. Don't mind me. Oh, if we come back in this room later and have moved, I will be so fucking furious. Like, kid. What are you doing, kid? You need my help? Oh. It's okay. We'll work together. If you want to get out of here, you need my help. Yeah, okay. Can you give me a boost? I'm trying to. Uh, what do I do? Grab you? I grab you. Because, yeah, from the um, screenshots of this game, it is like. I think it's a single player, but there's two characters. It definitely sounds like somebody's having fun upstairs. Alright, so we need to get a key. What was this that dropped down? Is that a shoe? It's a shoe. Something about shoes and little nightmares. Maybe the developers of a foot fish. Alright, we're, we're, we're following the sounds. There's mannequin bits there. Oh, I don't like this. 